Great North Woods to the Rockbound Coast and streaming live in HD worldwide at FoxBangor.com. More people choose Good Morning Maine. Today on Good Morning Maine, a man from Maine is sentenced to prison for his role in the attack on the Capitol. Plus, state regulators explain their decisions that led to higher electric rates here in Maine. And it looks like asylum seekers won't be relocating to Unity after all. Good morning and welcome to Good Morning Maine. I'm Emma Smith. And I'm Craig Colson. Thank you for joining us on this Friday morning. We'll have all the day's news coming up. But first, a check of that forecast. Uh, always important as we're heading into the weekend. Um, it's looking eh, a little shaky. Yeah. A, lot, a lot of clouds, chance of th- uh, scattered showers, thunderstorms. Typical stuff, but we really haven't seen any the last few days. I think that radar is going to be especially important to keep your eye on because like yesterday, I mean, we're forecasting clouds because Mm -hmm. there will be plenty of clouds, but they can move through quickly and a thunderstorm. It could just be, you know, one clap of thunder and lightning and that could be it. Usually happens late in the afternoon when the, you know, the cool air is mixing with the warm air. We just hope that there will be some relief from this humidity. It's it's hard to sleep, hard to do anything these days. Yeah, I know. Hard to do anything. (laughs) Right. All right, here's Devin Biggs with a forecast. And thank you very much, Craig and Emma. Happy Friday. Your first weather forecast brought to you by Dirt Road Acres, your number one dispensary providing outstanding customer service and award-winning knowledge at most affordable prices. All right, let's get the-